oh, I think we have this wonderful opportunity in front of us. Um, I mean, it's not easy. But there's a, um, and I, I can't remember where it comes from, but there's this, this idea of, of it goes back to changing cultures that you have to unfreeze the culture, and then you you know and then you 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 shift it the way you want, and then you refreeze it. Right. Uh, and I think that's a pretty good uh, description of where we are right now. It's thawing out there, folks. I mean, it, I mean the whole healthcare system is is turning itself upside down, and and that creates really great opportunity to think about, wow. What would care look like if we could redesign it you know, and, and we aren't worried about um, RVUs and, and payments? And, well, you know, so, so I think what's happening right now is that, is, is, that, that we're creating a tremendous um, the, the, the disruption. Disruption leads to innovation. And there's a lot of disruption in healthcare right now. It's just it's an opportunity to, to, to think about how am I going to create a future? How can I do this? Because it's always been like that to a certain extent. There's always been some government policy change. There's always been some technology change that was going to you know, change everything. And you know, the, the, the really leadership is about, I think, you know, leadership oftentimes is about taking those opportunities you know, to adapt and to you know, the change that goes on and say, I'm going to clear cut right through here. I can see how we could do this better and go do it.